Welcome back, Dr. Rob here. We're talking about the prophecy puzzle, trying to put these pieces together. We just had a look at the sun dark day. That would be the day of the Lord. Uh, Jesus says it will happen at the end of the great tribulation. And I believe that's the next thing on God's prophetic calendar. The next thing we want to look at is the rapture. The term rapture return, refers to the return of Jesus solely for the elect, solely for his church. Jesus will come and take the church to be with him while the apocalyptic judgments of Revelation fall on unbelievers and the kingdom of the Antichrist. There are differing beliefs on the rapture from outright denial to the rapture of a select few, and that leads to some burning questions. First, is there a rapture? Second, is there sufficient scripture to support such a hope? Third, where in the prophetic sequence will this occur? Fourth, who will be included? And five, how will it be manifested? Well, let's talk about some burning answers to those burning questions. Yes, there is a rapture of believers. I'm going to show you. Yes, there's more than enough scripture to support such a belief. And Jesus himself gives the sequence and the timing and who will be included. All right. Where does he do that? Back to Matthew chapter 24. And I'm going to read 